and Philo really attempted to marry together Plato's cosmology with his reading of the creation narrative in Genesis. And in many ways, he anticipates or perhaps stimulates some Gnostic ideas that would come later. According to Philo, God is the one who simply is, you know, immortal, immortal, invisible, ineffable. He makes the world, or he makes the heavens, and he makes the world through the Logos. And the Logos uses various powers called forms to help him shape the material world. And, and the forms kind of act the same way that Plato's young gods do. So this is an account of creation that sounds from Philo very much like, you know, uh, Plato and the book of Genesis have been put in a blender. Uh, God is the creator of the heavens, but he creates the material world through the Demiurge, who is identified as the Logos.